Finnish IT Centre for Science, CSC, has developed REMS for managing access rights to data resources and to ease their deployment. The development for REMS was done in Elexir project. REMS can now be used in Europe for biomedical data resources through Elexir. REMS can also be used in other branches of sciences, such as in social science and in language science. On this site you will see how a new user, Annie, is requesting access rights to Kite, which is a biobank service in development. REMS is integrated in this service for managing its access rights. The new user, Annie, logs into the Kite service using her federated identity. She is recognised in the service, but she doesn't have access rights to data resources. Annie is trying to access data in the Kite Biobank, but she won't get any results to her queries. Annie notices a Request Access button and presses it. Annie will now be directed from the Kite Biobank to the REMS Access Rights Management System to fill an application. After filling the application, the Kite Biobank also requests Annie to attach her research plan into her application. She is also asked to approve the license terms and conditions. Annie is also requesting access rights to her research team, as they need to have access to the data resources as well. Kite Biobank will now get a notice of a new application. The person responsible for managing access rights will read the application and audit Annie's federated identity. One application may also target several datasets at the same time. REMS has a versatile approval system. The person mainly responsible can also see other approvals in the system and approve Zani's application as well. Now the new user Annie receives an email confirming her access rights. She is now able to make queries to the dataset she required. Access rights can also be revoked easily in REMS. In a situation where access rights must be revoked, for example for a particular dataset, the responsible person at Kite Biobank can see who has access to this particular dataset from REMS and revoke the access rights in question. REMS has been deployed to manage access rights, for instance, in the Nordic Genetic Reference Data Resources, governed by Institute for Molecular Medicine, Finland.